Hello everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect Legendary Edition where, oh wow, Shepard has all of a sudden remembered that Pharos is currently under attack by the Geth. We should, we should really get on that. Ah, but side quests, Shepard, side quests. And then after we do this, we'll come back and chat with everybody again. It's just never, I'm, it's just gonna haunt me forever that I didn't go and talk to them after I got the ship initially. I was just too excited. We're going to Pharos, that's right. Yeah, I think I usually do Novaria, so this will be... I've done this once before because I knew that I usually did Novaria first. Maybe once or twice. I think it changes some of the dialogue in Novaria. It's rapidly volcanic. It doesn't super volcanoes are erupting across the planet. It makes natural diamonds plentiful, if extremely costly and dangerous to recover. Nobody really cares about diamonds again, except for in the technological fields. Like, who gets diamonds nowadays? You know, they're too expensive, and they're usually like harvested unethically. <laughs> we just want them. They're just in our tech, our tech stuff. Oh, pharaohs. Yes, yes, yes. Currently on fire. Pilot colony. Exogeny. Exogeny again. To explore Prothean ruins. It sucks that so much of like the future <laughs> is often and current, it, it seems like, is just controlled by like super wealthy corporations that seem to have very little ethics, as you'll see. Uh, the atmosphere is fouled with dust, terrestrial travel is hampered by crumpled debris, dozens of meters deep. There are indications that Pharaoh was a much colder world in the past. It has two moons. This is one of the places that has some of the most intact Prothean ruins left the galaxy, at least as far as we know. Prothean data disk. There were some strange readings. We pointed the source and located a strange object. Tally and Adams brought it on board and spent hours taking it apart. The purpose of the object is still uncertain, but it was a Prothean in nature and contained a Prothean data disk. The atmosphere is used as ammonia, methane, surprisingly large amounts of water vapor, making the atmosphere a striking mixture of blues, browns, and whites. That would be pretty. Uh, both look signs of former Prothea development, suggesting sharing may have been mined for Helium 3. Or something else. Dun dun dun. I think it was probably Helium 3. Yeah, this place, this whole system appears to have been like heavily used by the Protheans. There's remains of a Prothean mining infrastructure showing the, dotting the planet. Abandoned mines are connected to dead cities by collapsed back left lines. Unlike the crumbling skyscrapers of Pharos, Quanah's ruins are reasonably intact. Unfortunately, that only made it easier for looters to strip the silent necropoli of anything valuable. <laughs> it makes me so angry. Like, so much information is lost. So much knowledge is lost by looters just trying to make a quick buck. Like, I get it, and in a lot of cases, not a lot, in many cases, in some cases, looters are people like lower income people who are trying to make money to survive you know but like and then it, oftentimes they'll sal they'll, they'll what is it not salvage um they'll undermine their own like uh cultural like past you know by doing this like i'm thinking specifically of like in egypt right we're like selling like i remember at one point when i was reading from like the early 1900s a an acropoli was found of some like of some sort that had like that had like been like parts of it have been eroding out and so like a lot of like goods like grave goods and stuff have been eroding out of this area and people have been taking them and selling them and then like these explorers I don't know well fancy looters came in European looters came in who were sort of trying to be kind of scientific about it sort of maybe a little bit um, and removed everything so that it would you know documented it and like took it took it away so that they would you know be able to study it and like the people lined the river as they were like taking this stuff away and were like crying and upset that like potential like at least according to the 
the records that I read. It was because they were taking away a source of income. You know, this place was destitute, essentially, and it was like the only way any of them had made a living, really, because uh, it was just not a good place to farm or anything like that. And so, but it was just like heartbreaking on so many levels, you know, that like there was, they have to resort to like selling off bits of their ancient, you know, venerated culture to survive, you know, like if, if they, anyway, that's, I'm just ram rambling, not rambling, it's important stuff, but it's one of those hot topic buttons for me where I'm like looting blah, blah you can't like for the most part yes looting is bad and you're a terrible person if you do it but there are instances where I you, you can pity the people pity, pity I don't know if pity is the right word but you understand why they're doing it you know Logan <laughs> what a name for a planet uh, the survey team who charted the system 20 years ago reported many strange disturbances in Logan's cloud band, suggesting many remarkable large solid objects were present beneath the cloud tops. The ships approached, however, they subsided one by one. These disturbances have not been reported again. Oh, see, stuff like this just makes me wish we could just dive on in there, you know? Like, there's still so many mysteries in the galaxy, despite all the mysteries that we already know about, you know? It's so fun. It's cool. It's cool. I like it a lot. Let's go, Pharaohs. Anyway, that was a solid seven minutes of me not doing <laughs> Pharaohs. Sorry. This place is awesome. I can't wait to see it. All updated. Oh, maybe I should have saved beforehand. I know my friend was having a problem with Novaria glitching out for her. But we should be alright. Hopefully. I feel like that, like this upper panel and that area, like right where my head is, is like more detailed than it used to be. Cause sometimes like I come in and like the camera's like this. And I think I usually have it like this, so I can kind of see in front of her. But it looks to me like that's a doorway almost. And like, this is like a walkway. Like you, you see the optical illusion going on here? And there's like a, like following her head. Like there's a walkway there leading to like a doorway over there. But then I'm like this and I'm like, oh yeah, there it is. It takes me a second. Anyway, let's save. I know my friend said that her, like, Novaria stopped bugging out for her after the, like, the, the most recent update that came through. Got anything for me, Joker? Uh, I prefer gold to silver. Oh, you know, yeah. I figured you'd recommend me for one since I uh, pulled your boots out of the fire. If we present you with a medal, you'll end up sitting on stage listening to politicians make speeches for a couple of hours. That's a good point. You can only make me shave, too. I spent the last seven weeks working on this baby. No medal's worth that. <laughs> so, Commander, why don't you tell me why you're really here? Uh... How's the Normandy performing? Is she everything they said she'd be? She's the best ship in the fleet. Balance uh... isn't what you'd expect. The Normandy's probably too much ship for your average Alliance pilot, Commander. Lucky for you, I'm anything but average. Did we do all of these already? How'd you end up joining the Alliance? Look, if you're looking for an inspirational tale of the crippled kid overcoming impossible odds, you're gonna be disappointed. My mother was a civilian contractor working for the Alliance. I basically grew up on the Arcturus station back when they were building up the fleets. Spend all that time around Alliance ships, there's a good chance you'll end up going to the Academy. Okay. I have to go. Alright, see ya. Another codex entry. Nice. Okay, yeah. So we had, we had a little some some. Can't think of anything else that I have to talk to anybody about. You can only get like updates, like mission updates from Caden and Ashley when you've done a major mission, as far as I know. Ugh. I also just saw they just made equalizing interior pressure. So they have um, exterior atmosphere. The Garrus body pillow, right? Like logged. Garrus body pillow. Officer is ashore. I think either Exo Presley has the deck at Sanshi or at BioWare's merch site, but they just the uh, today, as far as I know, uh, released a tally body pillow, and I was like, hmm, well, at least they did a uh, Garrus's first, right? It's not just like, oh, here's our sexy ladies. Like, the first one that people asked for was a man, so... I'm like, alright, fine. I'll allow it. 
We saw your ship. Fidan wants to speak with you immediately. Ah? Who's Fidan? He's our leader. He needs your help to prepare for the Geth. They are making another push. Please, up the stairs past the freighter. Oh, jeez. I know that happens, but it's still like... Oh, oh hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. We have organic stuff. Let's do cryo around. Mac Axter is... Oh, I wish I could talk. I don't know if I want my max accuracy on my shotgun to go down, but let's let's give it a whirl. Let's try. It should also work on the ammo and the cry the incendiary and the cryo, which eventually become um abilities in the next game, actually. Those are fine. Try to get the ones that are specialized for organics out of there. Let's try some hacking. No, not gonna hack. and that's gonna help, but it will probably be easier to use the pistol and not the shotgun. The 
does Geth are bloody dangerous. Yeah, yeah, but you can't use bloody because you're not British. Glad to see some soldiers. Our numbers are getting thin. Down here first, the Geth will surely kill us all. There's no point really in talking to them. How is a woman supposed to think the gun's going off all around? Right now, they won't really talk to me unless I talk to Fidan first. I fear the Geth will kill us all. Yeah, 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 yeah. get by you, huh? Mm -hmm. Oh dang, I'm taking a long way. Could have gone through the, the thing. I didn't. Oh, Commander. I'm glad they finally sent somebody to help us. You're a bit late, aren't you? Arcelia. Sorry, Commander. Everyone's on edge since... Watch out! We've got Geth in the tower! Protect the heart of the colony! Ah! Take him out! Do it. Pick me. It's frustrating a little bit. Nope. Can't just like pull him out. You just gotta wait for him. Because I can't actually hang guard up to him and he's running to get Alright, here we go. I just walked right in front of the cryo animals working really well. Ooh, ooh, I can't. Oh, I'm stuck. I can't actually hide behind this. I think it died standing up. Look at that. Look at that. That's weird. I know that happens sometimes, but it's still like, whoa. Woo! All right, that's the method. You just gotta throw a barrier on. Why does it do that to me? I, I actually don't know. It's a little frustrating. I like walk up and I'm like just standing there and I'm like frantically pulling the trigger. I don't think I should go that way right now. Should I? Should I go take a look? Nah, it goes down. We don't want to go into the basement yet. I don't even know if you can. You probably could. Well, uh, okay, I don't, I don't. I don't care. What the? What the heck? I'm sorry, I don't know why the pop-up decided that it was gonna interrupt what else I was doing. It doesn't happen very often. Uh, let's go with.
getting out of here. Easy. The guest will be back. Update Fidan, but don't take long. We should roll out the vehicle and find where the geth are bunkered. Yeah, they're they're obviously camped out somewhere. Oh boy. Sure. Okay, I get advanced shield boost and advanced throw. I need to put points into barrier, I think. That will help me be more vanguardy. I should put points into shotguns too. Dang, I haven't done very much on my weapons. Alas. There's much more fun things to do. Advanced barrier, stasis. Uh, la, 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 la. But it doesn't always work, right? Like, it does, like, okay, so just having it, though, reduces, like, the hacking. Oh, we'll work on more advanced robotic enemies. Yeah, so let's work our way down to that. Because, yeah, I used it on... Well, the first one I tried to use it on, I thought would for sure work, but it didn't. The, the big guys that came in, the beefy ones, I was like, that might, that probably won't work. But... It was good to try. Oops, that's not... I'm trying to put my gun away. There we go. Nope. Maybe not a good idea to put the gun away when you're in an active war zone, but he's like already, and she's like, I'm pissed. I'm grateful for what you've done, but your heroics don't impress me, Commander. Oh, uh, okay. I get the feeling you don't like me. How would you feel if you were hung out to dry by every government organization that ever promised to keep you safe? They should have sent a small fleet. Instead, we get one ship, and you're only interested in the gap. Yep. Goodbye. I mean, Commander. theoretically, yeah. The tower's secure. Thanks to you, Commander. Like, I knew that they were under attack, I guess, but really, like, yeah, they should have had help, but Exogeny was just... not just dropped the ball. I'm just glad your colony's safe. I appreciate your concern and your efforts against the Geth. They may have been slowed, but they'll be back. They always come back. Help me find what the Geth are after and you'll all get out of here alive. We don't know what they're after. They came, they attacked us, that's all we know. Their main base is at the Exogeny headquarters. A good place to start looking if you want answers. What's Exogeny? It's the company most of us work for before the attacks. They fund this car. I should know what Exogeny is. The Skyway leads directly to Exogeny headquarters. You can't miss it. Of course, there's an army of Geth between here and there. I didn't expect this would be easy. I am an army. Then maybe I can get this colony operational. What can you tell me about the defenses the Geth have set up? I don't have any details, but I'll wager it's a lot more fortified than the command post. They landed at least one Geth ship at Exogeny, and I've seen large walking tanks on the Skyway. Expect a hard fight. Or a quick run, because sometimes all you gotta do is just run away. Okay, just a part of me just now got, like, sometimes you see your companions in the background, and a part of me just, like, got all butterflies in my stomach thinking about how Mass Effect 2 will have Thane! <laughs> what do you need done to get this place back on its feet? We need those Geth destroyed. Arcelia's right. There are still Geth in the tunnels. We also have more mundane problems like food, water, and power. I'm not sure where we stand on those matters. You should talk to the people overseeing them. I mean, I get like he's delegated, right? But still, he should be getting like regular updates. Yeah, I'm not gonna talk to him about Do you have those. information about Geth in the lower tunnels? Nothing new. They're in the tunnel somewhere, likely guarding a transmitter to coordinate attacks. It's not a critical threat right now, but getting rid of that transmitter will help us defend against further attacks. 
Let's talk about Zeus, Hope, and Pharos in general. Of course, Commander. Tell me about your colony. Life is hard and often brutal, even without our current problems. Colonial affairs back on Earth told us we'd be beneath the notice of any raiders. I guess they weren't counting on the Geth. But, despite everything, there's something tranquil about this place. Unlike anything I've experienced before. Uh-huh. The Normandy isn't huge, but we could airlift you out. The Geth fighters are too dangerous. And I won't be driven off this world. It is our home. There's a chance for growth here that's simply not available on other worlds. Uh-huh. How big was the original Pharos colony? We were nearly a thousand at the main site. Two hundred more at my outpost. When the first wave obliterated our defenses, we fell back to Zeus Hope. What else can you tell me about Exogeny? Exogeny funded this colony. Without them, we wouldn't be stuck here. They specialize in colonization. In return for bankrolling the colony, we work for them. Their main goal is the retrieval of valuable artifacts or resources. <laughs> Except there isn't anything here. Or if there is, we didn't find it. Retrieval of valuable artifacts. Like, only under the supervision and, like, the monitoring of, like, an actual archaeologist. Probably geologist. I'll talk to you when I learn more. Good luck, Commander. I'm a nice person. I got Paragon Boy. Let's talk to uh, I'm grateful Arcelia. for what you've done, but your heroics don't impress me, Commander. Tell me more about yourself, Arcelia. I'm a rent-a-cop. Oh. I had to keep kids from writing graffiti on the walls at Exogeny. Then all this happened. I wasn't trained for this. I didn't ask for it. I just wanted to end. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Uh, she's a rent-a-cop. Like, it's very different from, like, military action. You know, it's like a completely different ballgame. What can you tell me about the Geth? Do you have any idea what they might be after? I can't tell you anything about that. I suggest you go to Exogeny if you want answers to those questions. Mm-hmm. Can't tell me. Mm -hmm. Tell me about Zeus Hope. I can't tell you I much can't about tell. it. You should speak to Fidan if you want to know more. Interesting. What can you tell me about Exogeny? Very little. I work there as a security officer. I know they were looking for artifacts and anything of value. That's what they do. They fund the colony. In return, we help them uncover buried treasure. You can't just... It's definitely there's, not as exciting as they make it sound. There's rules for this. There's rules and regulations even on Earth now. I guarantee you there'd be stuff in space, especially concerning Prothean artifacts. The fact that they just plopped a colony down in the middle of a Prothean ruin is just like, and are like legally, air quotes, looting it. Like, that. There's got the council's got to not be okay with that. Like they're, or they're have, they have to be like in cahoots with the council and like, have to be like recording stuff and sending anything back of value in some way to like the council themselves but like you have to do it properly you can't just dig things up and throw it into a pile and hand it to people like half the information comes from context like where it is and what how it's located to other things and i realize this is probably a bunch of technology but like and that you could probably figure out how it works like you know if you plug it in somewhere but still like everything has a place and like where it was in relation to other things and like where it is and like the freaking like devotage and like the geologic layering like that matters it matters goodbye commander 